Good day, grade 6. Once again, I'm Teacher Jai and I'm about to discuss to you our first lesson in English. Let's proceed. So our first lesson is all about identifying real or make-believe images. But before that class, let us test your reasoning ability. So the choices are given after. So this activity will be done during your synchronous class. So the first one, I believe that talking to plants makes them grow fast because letter A, plants listen very well with their ears. Letter B, plants like humans can feel the love and care given to them. Next one, I find it impossible to breathe underwater because you only have 5 seconds to answer this one. Letter A, I don't have gills. Or letter B, I don't have tentacles. In 5, in 4, in 3, in 2, 1. For the third one, I know that green mangoes are sour because letter A, I always eat them. Or letter B, their color is green. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay, number 4. I think my best friend always tells the truth because letter A, she talks a lot. Or letter B, she values our friendship. In 5, in 4, in 3, in 2, and one okay time's up let's proceed to the last one grade six okay for the last one i am amazed by the sun's heat because letter a it gives light or letter b it can dry wet clothes in five four three two one okay Okay, so that's it, grade 6, okay? So, uh, we are about to discuss that during our synchronous class, okay? For now, class, now let us read this selection, okay? So, Bea lives in the small barangay of Santa Rita in the town of Autumn. Every day, she wakes up early to go to the farm and feed their family's carabao. That day, after her morning routine, she decided to drop by her favorite spot by the pan. She sat down for a couple of minutes and talked to her reflection in the water. Her nanai had once told about the water appearing in the water of the pan. Anybody who talks to her reflection by the water will see the water and can make a wish. So Bea tried her luck. When Bea was about to open her mouth, a beautiful face appeared, surely not her own reflection. Because she wanted to prove that it was real, she rubbed her eyes again and again. To her dismay, when she looked at the water, the face suddenly disappeared. Bea was disappointed for missing her chance to talk to the Dewata. She went home as fast as she could and told her nanai about what happened. Okay, so that's it, grade six. So according to the selection, of there are uh, there will be questions to be discussed by next meeting according to the selection that we read. Okay, so please be ready. So now, class, let us remember. Let us remember that when we say the word real images, okay, real images, real images are true. They are facts that can be proven. They can be experienced or witnessed by a person. So real images, they are provable, could happen in real life or exist. So again, when we say the word real from its real images, from its word real meaning, it exists, okay? And we can see, hear, feel, taste, or even touch them 
Okay? So, these are the examples. Okay, but before that, class, kindly also remember that you, when identifying statements that express reality, one should look into things, ideas, and events based on real-life experience using the five senses. So we will use your, uh, we will, you will use your five senses, okay? Whenever you will explain this real or identify this real images or statements. So what are those five senses? Seeing, smelling, tasting, hearing, or feeling. Now, for the examples. Babies cry when they are hungry, of course, right? So, babies really or most babies really cry when they are hungry. The next one is there are seven days in a week. And the last one is my grandmother is still alive at the age of 93. So, the next one is what we call as make-believe. So, make-believe images have no existence. No existence. They are not true. They are in our imagination. They are non-fact and difficult to be proven. So, make-believe images, they are created in our minds. They are exaggerated most of the time. That is why they are unbelievable to happen. Also remember class that make believe could not happen in real life and just a pure imagination. Why? Because it doesn't actually exist. Okay, these are the examples. The tree talked to the boy. The fisherman caught a mountain of fish last night but still was penniless it was raining cats and dogs the water flooded the city and it almost reached the clouds observe class okay kindly observe the difference of the examples between real and make believe So, these are the other examples also. The first one, of course, the difference between real and make-believe. So, they are both turtle. But the first one is a real turtle, of course. Okay? Well, the second one is a ninja turtle. And then the next one is the real one, of course. This is Angel Oxin. She is a Filipino actress. And the next one is an example of make believe. We're in Angel looks in just portrays Darna. And Darna is just a pure fiction, okay? Pure fiction or a television series before. So now, class, let us test your ability, okay? So this will be done during your synchronous class. So kindly prepare your whiteboards and let us test your knowledge. Are you ready? So let's thumbs up. Okay, very good. Study the following images. Which one truly exists or pure imagination? So kindly write the real if it's a real or make believe if it isn't or it could not happen in real life because it doesn't actually exist or just pure imagination you may start in five four three two one number one elsa from frozen again number one elsa from frozen number two Wonder Woman Number 2 Wonder Woman Number 3 Tom and Jerry Number 3 Tom and Jerry Number 4 Cat Number 4 Cat And the last one Coronavirus or COVID-19 Coronavirus or COVID-19 Okay 
If you are done, please boards up. Okay, very good. Grade is six. Okay, now let's proceed. Okay, once again, thank you for your active participation. Other details will be discussed during your synchronous class. So kindly take note of this of this recorded video and be ready for our discussion next meeting again, God willing. Okay, thank you so much.